Mike asks, would it help to focus on the consequences of failure? And, you know, so as we, uh, as I discussed in, in the goal setting uh, sheet that came in, um, yes, it can help to focus on the consequences of failure. Focus on the amount of money that your distractions cost you, the amount of money that your failures or risk management cost you, right? Focus on that. I mean, uh, well, that's certainly one of the things I've done with, with poker players over the years, right? When they, when they struggle to put in those extra few hours, uh, you know, on a consistent basis and we start to add up, okay, well, you've given up a half hour here, an hour there, it adds up to five this week. Sure. As a one-off, not that big of a deal. You're doing that week over week, over 40 weeks, talking 200 hours, you're talking maybe a month, a month and a half of actual time. And so when you start to think about, well, my God, oh, you know, year over year, I could gain an extra month and a half just by pushing myself a half hour a day or you know an hour a day, like that's, pretty incredible. And so, yeah, sometimes we can be motivated by pain and motivated to avoid that pain. Um, but sometimes we also need to understand why it is that we have been failing in the past, why it is that, you know, that time has been, you know, kind of bleeding. And if you don't do that, then, um, you know, it, you're going to kind of get tripped up, right? It's going to be hard to sustain it because, Sometimes that 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 number, right? The sticker shock of well, it, this you know, uh, failures of my my risk management cost me 10k a month, right? Sticker shock. You know, we we become accustomed to things, right? It's it's easy to become sort of inoculated to uh, that information, and eventually it's just like, meh, you know, all right, so I'm giving up, you know, a month and a half of my life, but I'm getting this, not, you know, it's just it's tough. So you have to kind of really dig a little bit deeper and figure out why it is. That you're failing to put in the time that you want why it is that you're breaking your risk management rules why it is that you're failing and if you do that then you're more likely to be successful long term 